So the Gospel reading for the 21st of September is from Matthew chapter 9, verses 9 to 13. As Jesus passed by, he saw a man named Matthew sitting at his customs post. He said to him, follow me. And he got up and followed him. While he was at table in his house, many tax collectors and sinners came and sat with Jesus and his disciples. The Pharisees saw this and said to his disciples, Why does your teacher eat with tax collectors and sinners? He heard this and said, Those who are well do not need a physician, but the sick do. Go and learn the meaning of the words, I desire mercy, not sacrifice. I did not come to call the righteous, but sinners. What Jesus is asking us to focus on in the Gospel today is precisely that. To focus on our response to people's situations, not in judgment and not in the sense that we will, in a sense, ourselves sacrifice for them, but to learn to be able to put ourselves in their situation and to have mercy to be compassionate, to grow in compassion, to grow in our capacity for empathy and not just simple judgment. Sacrifice can, can be good, but sometimes sacrifice is too much about the person who is making the sacrifice rather than the other person in the story. And what Jesus goes to great pains to uh, emphasize in his ministry is that life is all about relationships. Relationships are what are important for us as human beings. In the middle of this pandemic, one of the things that we've been challenged with is the fact that it's been difficult to remain in relationship physically with other people because we've been told you cannot touch, you cannot shake hands, you cannot kiss. And so we have to be able to find different ways of reaching out to one another. Relationships are at the heart of everything we are as human beings. And Jesus says, at the heart of our relationships must be mercy. We cannot make judgment the first thing that comes to our mind. We cannot make judging other people the focus of our relationships. It has to be mercy. It has to be seeking to build those relationships and improve them, not just, you know, be critical uh, where we can be critical. Jesus calls us to love one another as he has loved us. And we ourselves ought to know from our own experience of God in our lives that what is important in our experience of God is that he's forgiven us, that he's forgiven us our sins. He hasn't stood in judgment over us and waved his finger in our face and said, oh, you're a naughty little boy or a naughty little girl. What Jesus has said to us, he has said, come to me, all you who labor and are burdened. Come to me and I will give you rest. I forgive your sins. I want to get to know you better. I want to be in relationship with you. That's what mercy is all about. Mercy is all about building relationships with others. So let us hear the gospel today as a call to mercy and a call to build our relationships with family, with friends, and with those around us. Thank you very much.